we'll get right into it. So I've had the pleasure of talking to a lot of you throughout the week um, in your advisories and your classes in the hallways, and having me so excited to be here today. I chose to start by saying thank you to any of you who vote for me. But a little background on me and my family is I'm close to all, all the hallways at our house. I just know my mom works so hard so we can draw our quality time together and make memories. I also have learned to respect tradition, but also put my own twist on it to make it more fun. This upbringing of always making things feel more special is the reason I'm right today. I've been over the last two years that things that I did like special have been taken away. And when it's because of COVID or other reasons, I have to see this effect on school spirit. I hope that by having new hour of our school blessings, I will be able to make our school a better place and create the best events. Speaking of events and homecoming is coming up, I have one place for homecoming. I cannot allow these beautiful girls in expensive dresses to be photographed and put an orange plastic tablecloth to tape to the wall. <laughs> I know that they come from a feel much more special. And I know these events take a lot of hard work, and this is something I'm not a stranger to. After only looking at homeless for a short period of time, I was with an associate reporter for teamwork, leadership, and work ethic. and I like to determine I'll do whatever it takes. And this is their problem. I would join the Pump Committee and as a team, but I feel like I have been training for Pump for years now. I have done countless team escapes and have made dozens of balloon gardens. But for a fee, I was in Great Gatsby with bolts of shaded layers and tall centerpieces of pearls. Or I was in a building garden with one of the statues and finding up the wall of red roses. But I'm totally open to other ideas. But none of them are not fundraising, and I know that together we can get it done. And before I see my clothes with treatments, I want you to know that I know what the job entails. I know it's more than just a problem. Um, I know I need to make your fundraising. I know I need to plan a reunion. I know I need to run weekly meetings. And I know there's much more that I need to do, especially because we're seniors now. I know it because I know I can do that with a good attitude and creativity. Overall, I have one thing to say. I'm not running this on the my resume. I don't even want to college yet. I'm running for more selfish reason. I want us to have fun school year. And I know I'm best to do that. But it's not just my sphere, it's all of ours. I hope to connect you guys and we represent what you want for serious headlines and other major events and overall bring back school spirit. Good morning, class of 2022. My name is Don Luciano and I'm running to be your class president. A class president's job is to represent their class in all sorts of ways, in and out of the classroom. It's more than just the big events like prom and homecoming or something that includes a college application. It's a position that needs to be filled by a person who cares for not only our class, but for the entire school. It doesn't stop after graduation either. Our president plans the post-graduation events as well. I plan to put in the work so all of you can experience the fun. With past experience as president and vice president, I have gained skills to be the perfect candidate to accomplish this. Previously, as the president, we were able to accomplish many events through the difficult COVID era. Weekly shenanigans help keep students stay connected during crazy times. A 33 hilltop fundraiser that earns over $350 for our class. A Valentine's Day fundraiser. A successful Mr. WHS. And a safe and amazing prom. I'm looking forward to putting together numerous events for this school year. Homecoming, Power Pop, Pep Rise, and Spirits. And specifically for us, our senior trip, senior prom, and our last night at WHS. I plan to not just work with the student government, but all of you as well. We will have student communities for homecoming, prom, our senior trip, power puff, and our last night to make sure everyone has a chance to make the event better. I am asking for your vote so that we can accomplish great things this year. Vote Don Pichano, class president. Thank you. Good morning, seniors. My name is Dylan Lewis, and I'm running for Vice President in the class of 2022. As Vice President last year, I worked alongside my fellow delegates to organize several events, such as prom and fundraisers, and I hope to bring back other events that we missed out on last year, like Powder Puff and Pep Rallies. I enjoyed the cooperation and comradeship that I experienced last year, especially throughout the hardships and uniqueness brought on by an unusual school year, and I look forward to the opportunity to be part of it again. As an active participant in numerous school organizations, particularly theater and sports, I have developed strong communication skills and great in working with teams, which further establishes my qualifications for this position. As your Vice President, I am to listen to any complaints or changes you want to see happen, and will work tirelessly to see that those changes and requests are met. If 
getting elected as vice president of the class of 2022, my goals will remain the same as they have in previous years. To make our class the model for incoming and future grades by promoting positive values such as honesty, integrity, and responsibility. With that said, I hope I have convinced you why you should choose me to be your vice president. Thank you very much. Hi everybody, um, I'm Julian, I'm running for treasurer, and I'm super excited for this year as we have a lot to think about as seniors. Um, our last HOCO, prom, our senior gift, and um, our senior trip, which I know we all want to be great and memorable considering that so many parts of our high school career have been robbed from us. Things like decorations are obviously ways that we can help um, make them memorable and fun. However, these things do cost money. <laughs> So I have a lot of ideas for fundraisers, but I would really love your input for what you guys would actually pay for and participate in. It's also important to keep in mind that we would also have, um, we'd also like to have money for future things like reunions and stuff, if you actually like to attend those. Um, and if none of this is your thing, don't worry. I know that we all have our own thing that we care about, so I would really love to hear your ideas about things that you'd like to see or things you would, um, you know, like to see how it happens, but anyways, that's it. Thank you for listening. Have a great day. I'm class of 2022. I'm Hannah Alexandra, and I'm running for class of 2022 again. I've been historian since freshman year, so I know it has affected at me as a member of student council and specifically as a historian. Part of my job is keeping a photo history of our class. I know at this point, I think most, if not all of you, so it's really easy for me to do this job. Um, I'm easily contactable through, like, in the hallways, social media, or just by phone. Um, this allows me to share, tell everyone's story. Vote for me for class historian so we can have a great senior year. Hello, class of 2022. I'm Kaylee Sinnott, and I'm running for secretary of the senior class. I was secretary last year for the junior class, president of the prom committee, and I'm currently the secretary of the National Honor Society. I have great organizational skills and extremely efficient in keeping the student council on task and prepared for all of our events and meetings. This year, I'm also fundraise a lot, so we as a class can purchase things and throw many events throughout the year. The more money we raise, the more things we be able to afford in order to make our senior year fun. As always, I want to incorporate the ideas and thoughts of the student body and be able to plan and organize a senior year that everyone is excited for. Thank you. Good morning, everyone. Uh, as you said, I'm uncontested and uh, so please vote for me if I'm not your only choice for your student class representative. We've uh, lived our whole lives to be seniors, so let's make it count. I've been a senior here for the past two years, Bill, and your lovely fellow members over there. And uh, I've been continuing helping them, planning events, making flyers, and doing the best I can to help around, because that's kind of what student reps do. So let's make this the most memorable years of our lives, or year of our lives. And both me for your student class representative. Thank you. I'm Tyler Linda, and I'm running this year as one of your class representatives. So, as a class representative, I'd be responsible for assisting other officers and duties, as well as your class advisors and enemies necessary. And although it's more than a key goal, I do believe it's so much significant to maintain a coordinated council. And I'm running this year because I believe the student council has many great opportunities before them and many positive improvement. Um, to which my accomplishments and skill sets can help achieve. And after enduring two unprecedented and exhausting years, I think that we, as seniors, should feel and do feel entitled to a memorable and enjoyable senior year, um, whatever that may personally mean to you. So whether you're the type of person who values a more relaxed, easygoing year, or if you're an added member of all the events, I'll just be here to contribute my time, ideas, and effort into our student council planning um, for a number of the senior year because we definitely do deserve them. Um, so if you like anything about that, I am one of the contestants with me, so just feel free to vote. Um, but thank you so much for listening, and have a great day. Your class publicist that is running is going to be Stephanie uh, Wong, and Kat Atkinson is running for school board representative.